let's take a look at the Mercy Medical Center story. It began September 24, 1851, when the Sisters of St. Augustine left France at the invitation of the Bishop of Cleveland to begin a health care ministry there. One year later, they formed a new community, the Sisters of Charity of St. Augustine. They came to Stark County in 1883 to open an orphanage in Louisville. In September of 1908, a widow by the name of Rosa Jansen Clorer petitioned the Bishop of Cleveland to open a Catholic hospital in Canton, Ohio. She knew of the good work of the Sisters of Charity of St. Augustine and asked that they come to staff the hospital. Rosa Clore purchased a home owned by President William McKinley. The sisters agreed to staff the hospital, and in that home, Mercy Medical Center began. Our doors opened on September 24, 1908, the Feast of Our Lady of Mercy. This slide shows the McKinley home and the prominent addition to the hospital. It was located on the corner of 8th Street and Market Avenue, beside St. Peter's Church. The hospital continued to grow at its downtown site. In 1950, the Timken family recognized the need that the sisters had to expand the ministry. The downtown hospital had become landlocked with no place to grow. The Timken family donated their family home and estate to the sisters. The sisters turned the mansion into a 68-bed facility, made the swimming pool the chapel, and opened Timken Mercy Hospital. In 1970, with the opening of the 10-story patient tower, the downtown hospital was no longer needed. It was demolished, and the public library now stands on that site. When we celebrated our centennial in 2008, the Cant Repository referred to the history of Mercy as a story of two homes. It truly is, as it began with the McKinley home and continues with the Timken home. We also engage in community outreach, having offered supportive programs in Southeast Canton for over 15 years and helping with social needs wherever possible. For example, during floods, Mercy provided 100 box lunches for people affected in Northeast Canton. As a Catholic health care organization, our mission at Mercy Medical Center is to continue Christ's healing ministry by providing quality, compassionate, accessible, and affordable care for the whole person. We are recognized for excellence, for holistic care, and for many health care firsts in our county, state, and even in the nation. Mercy is a member of the Catholic Health Association and with other Catholic providers in our own health system and others around the country, we share a common identity. We look to the future with a common vision. As you can imagine, these are very challenging times. These challenges are not all economic, though the economy is a huge challenge today. We must be very wise stewards of our resources, yet we must remain true to our mission of caring for all and of living the church's preferential option for the poor. We are called to care for the most vulnerable members of our community, as we have done for over 100 years. Every day we are called to balance mercy and justice. It remains a challenge to keep all associates and physicians educated in the traditions and commitments of Catholic health care. Everyone needs to be on board with the mission, and we continually focus on this. The Sisters of Charity of St. Augustine have as their motto, taken from Scripture and from St. Augustine, in omnibus caritas, in all things charity. It is indicative of how Catholic health care seeks to serve. Even very difficult decisions are to be made with love as we look to the example of Jesus the healer.